We all love a classic t-shirt. This one doesn't work for me. As you can see, it hugs every curve in my body. Midriff, back fat, doesn't hit me at the right place on my arm, even though it's black. So the go-to tee works for me because it has everything that's perfect. I love the neckline. You can still wear jewelry, but doesn't crowd the neck. The sleeve length is perfect. It's a three quarter sleeve, so it hides my arms. And it does sort of, it, it goes down the curves of the body. So it shows off the feminine silhouette, but it doesn't, it's not like a suction cup. It doesn't hold in. So again, what it does is nips in underneath the bust line and then just sort of softly cascades down. So as you can see, it kind of minimizes things. Don't see too much of the back fat and the front. I like the little bit of the curved hemline on this with the slits. So it gives you kind of room and it gets the eye coming up and it's the right length. It just covers what I want covered. And it's so you can wear it with a wide pant or an hour pant. So the go-to tee is called the go-to tee because that's what you just want to go to. In the morning, you just take it out and then you can layer things on with it. I actually have three of these go-to tees in black from Simply because I wear them so often, throw it in the washing machine, hang it to dry, and I wear it all year round. But you know, I'm wearing the black, and as I say, I'm wearing size 18. Now, let's just see what Lisa can do with it. Thanks, Marlene. This is the go-to tee in lapis blue, and this is what the go-to tee does for me. I love the way it floats over my high tummy. Let's take a look at what I contend with as an inverted triangle. So here's what the go-to tee does for me. My body shape is an inverted triangle. Typically, an inverted triangle is characterized by a wider shoulder and a square or more narrow hip. So I'm only one size different, so it's not too drastic, but here's what I contend with. I have a high tummy, so whenever I wear something too fitted around my midsection, I'm just focused that about the fit and feel of the garment. So when I do this, you can see that there's a little muffin top here. Sometimes it's bigger than other times. It starts about here and it comes up high, and that's what I deal with with my body shape. So whenever I wear something too constricting on my tummy, it just doesn't feel good. So here's me sitting down in my go-to tee, a little bit of pearl styled up, and I'm not thinking about that midsection. That usually makes me feel very uncomfortable. So there's lots of ways that you can style up the go-to tee. I've added the go-to shirt, the icon go-to shirt, in brush strokes. So it adds the pattern, but again, I unify and sort of lengthen the whole silhouette with the black underneath it. And finishing it off with one of these wanted freshwater pearl pendants. So I've done something a little different here. I've added the short tunic top. So this just comes to my waist. So I've left the go-to tee peeking out underneath it. So again, gives me that layered look, covers what I want covered, but adding the kind of flavor personality up top. This is a crinkled kind of mesh with a polka dot from Charlie B. It's an extra large and it gives it just a whole different look. Hi, I'm Stephanie and I am wearing one of my regular plain old everyday t-shirts. Uh, I like it, I wear it for layering. I would not necessarily wear it on its own and I'll tell you why. I find that I look full in the bust and broad in the shoulder, so really quite top heavy compared to my bottom half. Um, and as an inverted triangle I, in a t-shirt, I look for something that is gonna help balance out my silhouette. So let me show you what the go-to tee does for me. Wow, what a difference. What do you guys think? I, for me, the three quarter length sleeve makes the huge amount of difference. I love the scoop neckline, really helps to balance out my fuller bust. And of course the rounded hemline uh, just skims right across the hips so I don't have anything hugging against the tummy. Everything's floating away from the back. The three quarter sleeve is balancing out my shoulder and bust line. I feel pretty great. Now, let's style it up. Why not pair your go-to tee with a pant with personality? One of the best things about the Simply Go-To Tee is that you don't have to dress it up. So you can just throw on your favorite scarf, a great necklace, and 
away you go. So easy to wear to work too. Just throw on your favorite jacket, great long necklace to elongate the silhouette, and you're all set. And of course, a great classic is pairing it with your favorite cashmere topper. Looking for something that'll take you from day to evening? Why not try a funky lantern pant in the same fabric as your go-to tee? Elaine, just like the others, I've got a tummy to contend with, so I like the shape of this t-shirt, but look at the back. So I've got the back rolls because the t-shirt is tight. I want to make it just right. So here's what the go-to tee does for me. Open neckline elongates the neck. Slim fitting close to the body falls straight on the side front and back and those back rolls believe me they're still there but they're really nicely camouflaged with this top. So I've paired my white go-to tee with the painted lines pant, lantern pant, both from Simply, navy and white, fresh, bright combination for spring. Then I added the chic shirt for twice the stripes, twice the chic. The spark jumpsuit features an exaggerated cowl neck, which is why it needs something nice and slim to wear underneath it. And then the leg is a wide crop pant. Shop the looks at shepherdsfashions.com.